It's gonna go ahead and replace our drive belt. It's located right on the front side of your engine, attached to all of your accessory drive pulleys. It's good to remove our engine cover here. On the front are two little plastic locking buttons. You can use a flathead screwdriver. Simply go in, turn those there, about a quarter turn, that should unlock those. That allows us to simply pull up, pull this off. And on the back side, you're just gonna have those little rubber grommets here that are holding this in. So just pop that off and set it aside. Let's go ahead and remove our serpentine belt. And on the bottom here, we have a tensioner between our harmonic balancer and our AC compressor right here. And what we're gonna do is put a 19 millimeter socket on here and we're gonna slowly turn this counterclockwise. This is gonna compress the shock here or this little unit right here and then we'll remove that belt. Now you wanna do this slowly and we'll compress that. Okay, remove that belt, and then we can release that tensioner nice and slow. A little tip for you right now, before you remove your serpentine belt from all of your pulleys, now's the perfect time to sketch it or take a picture of it with your phone. That way there, when it comes time for reinstallation, you know exactly what pulley it goes around. Let's go ahead and feed our belt down. Down and down. So this belt is going to run over. The upper part of the belt runs over to your alternator. The lower part of the belt runs around the back side of this tensioner here. On the upper belt, I'm actually gonna put a little clip on here. This is just gonna hold the belt on the upper portion here so we can go down below and continue running that belt. Right, so this belt is gonna come down. It's gonna run around our harmonic balancer. Runs around the AC compressor to our tensioner here. And then it runs around to our alternator. So at this point here, we're gonna go ahead and compress this tensioner and then pull our belt up and over. Now once you have your belt on, you wanna go ahead and make sure that the belt is routed around all of your pulleys and is fully seated in all of the grooves and all of the accessories. If not, the belt itself can work its way off, can shred and cause damage. So at this point here, everything looks like it's in good condition. We're all set. Now at this point here, you wanna go ahead and hop in the vehicle, go ahead and start it up. You wanna make sure that everything is operational as it should be. Once everything checks out at that point there, you can go ahead and install your engine cover. Once we get this lined up, and these are screwdriver to lock in our push pins here, our little lock tabs, and you're all set. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.